Hello, my name is Jean and welcome to InspireYouthful.com where I share the art of ageless living. Today is going to be a total girls video because I will be sharing what's in my makeup bag. But before I reveal the stuff I use to help me have youthful skin and help me have an ageless look, I want to tell you why I changed my beauty products and regimen and how it's helped me and my skin and overall health. Like all women, I've gone through many different makeup styles or, or makeup periods. Times where I wore a lot of makeup and times when I hardly wore any. I think makeup is a way to express yourself and even deeper than that, it's, it also reflects your state of mind. I grew up not being able to wear makeup. I remember in junior high, girls telling me that perhaps if I wore some makeup, I would be prettier. And because of course, all girls want to be seen as pretty, I, I started wearing lip gloss. By the time I was in high school, I was drawing in my eyebrows like Groucho Marx trying to look like my best friend at the time because she had these beautiful thick eyebrows. I basically look silly. Of course, there were times when my eyebrows, uh, I practically shaved off my eyebrows and just drew them in with a pencil and I looked surprised all the time. Um, to think back on my eyebrow history is pretty embarrassing. In my late 20s, I went through a period where I didn't wear makeup and I wore sweats all the time. You could imagine what my state of mind was like back then. It wasn't until my 30s where I felt like I found my look. Um, I found how to be comfortable in my own skin and really started to appreciate what was beautiful about me. Um, not just on the outside but on the inside. I think for most women, it's easier to discount what is beautiful and good about you and more likely that you focus on what is flawed, imperfect, and what, are you, what you believe to be your failures. In this regard, I can only say that finding yourself, that discovering your inner beauty and uncovering your outer beauty is the most wonderful journey you can um, embark on. And that journey begins with holding spirituality as a bigger priority in your life. My 30s for me was a quest to become healthier in mind, body, and spirit. It was a time that I decided to eat better, move a little bit more, and get back into meditation and prayer. It was also a time where I started to change my beauty and makeup regimen. So I cleaned up my drawers and threw a whole bunch of makeup away and started all over. There's more to the story than that, but that's the gist of it. Anyhow, now I wash my face with brown sugar and olive oil. I brush my teeth with neem toothpaste and I try to have the most natural makeup regimen possible. I basically turned into a hippie, but in such a good way, I think, because the natural way is really the way to go. Going natural, like using olive oil for my face and body moisturizer, I believe is what has helped me to have clear and youthful looking skin at the age of 40. Using products that are toxic chemical free, I feel like I'm protecting my body from unnecessary exposure to harmful chemicals that may cause cancer for me in the future. And supporting companies that create healthy and sustainable products um, is a good thing because with our dollars, we show companies what we want. And if we continue to support um, companies that create healthy and sustainable products, then that's the kind of products that will be coming onto the market. To learn my skincare regimen, watch my video on the benefits of olive oil. Alright, so 
Drum roll, please. Let's start with what's in the makeup bag. Woohoo! All right. I'm gonna go by order of which I put the makeup on my face. I think that's the best way. Hey, so I had to switch over to show you what I use by picture because my dogs didn't want to be quiet anymore. But I'll try to make it as fun and exciting as possible. Let's begin. So after my olive oil moisturizer has been absorbed by my skin, I apply a natural primer around my eyes and face. My primer of choice is this amazing cosmetics anti-aging face primer. Primer helps to keep my makeup in place and this particular primer has anti-aging benefits so I love it even more. I've tried numerous primers and this is the one I've used for the last few years and I'm very happy with it. It's also paraben free and fragrance free and of course not tested on animals. Then I apply a tinted moisturizer and the tinted moisturizer of my choice is by Bare Minerals because it does not have parabens, sulfates, synthetic fragrances, synthetic dyes, and other chemicals that I would like to avoid. I choose to wear a tinted moisturizer instead of a full coverage foundation because the latter just looks too heavy to, for me. Also, heavy foundations can make you look older and settle in your fine lines, although a good primer will prevent that from happening. I'm not averse to foundation. I would opt for it for a special event where I want it to look flawless, but for everyday use, I think it's a lot. Next, I use a concealer to cover up any dark circles and imperfections I may have, I love Josie Moran's concealer. First, all her products from ingredients to packaging are natural and socially responsible. She's created a beauty line that is wonderful and an effective alternative to the usual makeup. And so I love buying and supporting her brand. I use concealer just underneath the eyes, next to the nose area, as well as on the nose and upper lip area. I set the concealer with loose powder, applying powder only on my nose, eyes, and upper lip area. I do not wear powder all over my face as I think can make you look older and too made up. I may use more powder when I go out at night, but most of the time I don't. And my powder of choice is Bare Minerals because again, they are made without harmful chemicals. My favorite makeup product is bronzer also made by Bare Minerals. If I was stuck on an island with only one piece of makeup, it would have to be my bronzer. It just makes you look so healthy and vibrant looking. Aside from my skin, it's the thing that I get the most compliments on. I use bronzer right underneath my cheekbones, a little on my forehead, and a little on my chin to give me that overall youthful glow that I love. My next favorite makeup is blush. I don't know how popular this brand is, but it was a lucky find for me. It's from Laura Geller and it has the beautiful pinks and golds that really help you brighten up your face. And of course, it's all natural. I use blush on the apples of my cheeks and sometimes a little bit as eyeshadow. Then I draw in thicker eyebrows with my Anastasia brow pencil and highlighter. Now Anastasia products are not known to be chemical free and it's my goal to change it. So if any of you have a healthy eyebrow pencil alternative, please share it with me. For now, I don't feel so bad um, supporting her brand because it also means supporting the charitable organization her company supports, which are numerous and they um, support children and women around the world. Next, I put on a little eyeshadow to create brighter looking eyes with my Josie Moran eyeshadow kits.
After that, I will use my Tarte eyeliners. Tarte is another cosmetic company that chooses to create natural and eco-friendly products. I use their clay pencil for my day look and now they just came out with a liquid liner which I will be using for my evening look. And of course I love making cat eyes because they give the appearance of a lifted eye and I think they're really pretty. Finding a natural mascara that works can be tricky, but I finally found one and it's by Physicians Formula. Uh, it's called their Organic Wear Fake Out Mascara. It's 100% free of harsh chemicals, synthetic preservatives, synthetic fibers, parabens, and uh, even gluten and dyes. So it's a great mascara and it works. Finally, I put it all together with what I think is my signature look, my pink lips. First, I use Bare Minerals as a lip moisturizer, then apply the Tarte lipstick called Foxy, and voila! 40 and fabulous! Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you found this information fun and useful. Check out my other videos about Ageless Beauty and visit me when you can at InspireYouthful.com. Bye for now.